What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Ricky Rick, and your boy, Ricky Rick, is back with another Ricky Talk. And today, I'm here to talk to you guys about the Los Angeles Rams cornerback, Jalen Ramsey. If you guys haven't heard in the last 48 hours, Jalen Ramsey is now going to be a Miami Dolphin. And I think, as a Rams fan, I speak for Rams fans, as the only Rams fans that I know in my certain circle, in my world <laughs> because i don't really know too many Rams fans but i will say this you know what do i think the rams made a mistake by trading Jalen ramsey i don't think so uh did we get anybody good for him i don't think so but hear me out last year last season even though it was a bad season it was a horrible season ugly season a season that i wish we can have back so we can run it back and have a shot at going back to back to the super bowl I will say this, Jalen Ramsey had moments, had moments. He even went out there in one of those games last season and said, I'm him, I'm him. But even him couldn't do it alone. He couldn't do it alone. And I feel like us Rams fan, you know, yes, we did send Jalen Ramsey to Miami, which happens to be a good team already and just got better with Jalen Ramsey as their new addition, but I think Jalen Ramsey, we get, we got something out of it, you know, he did come to LA, he did do his thing, he gave us some good years, and brought us a Super Bowl to LA. Last season, even though it was a bad season, a horrible season, I will say this, there's a lot of young guys in our roster who are waiting for the opportunity to step up, and why wait? Let's give that opportunity now. Just like the Lakers. The Lakers had a bunch of young guys that were good, that had potential. But we didn't want to wait for that time. And the Rams, I feel like we had some guys ready to explode. But they need to be out in the field and get that experience. Jalen Ramsey, we already know what he can do. We already know what he can bring. And we probably got some of the best years out of him already. And sure, he has a little bit left in the tank. But it's only a matter of time when we were going to trade him. If not this year, maybe next year, maybe two years from now. And then the the options of us getting anything back, we're going to be a little bit limitless, you know? So to me, I think the Rams did a good thing by letting him go. We got a, what, a third round pick? The Rams are good as long as we have Matthew Stafford, Aaron Donald, and Cooper Cup. You know, there's a little rumors out there that we might see um, Robert Woods. OBJ is still an option. Um, yeah, I think any of those two guys coming back to the Los Angeles Rams will be a better decision, a better addition than keeping Jalen Ramsey. You know, even though I did like Jalen Ramsey, but he, he had moments, like I said, moments. If we can play a good game, we don't really need him. Just me, man. But I am going to miss the guy. I am thankful for his time in L.A. I am thankful for the moments he did give us as the Los Angeles Rams. And I wish him the best with the Dolphins. I hope he doesn't win the Super Bowl with the Dolphins. But just like Von Miller, he's another guy that I really enjoyed his time playing for L.A., playing for the Rams. I'm going to miss him. Jalen Ramsey. Um, thank you. Thank you for the championship. Thank you for the memories. Thank you for the Sundays that you gave us. Made me a happy guy. Won me some money. Won me some <clears throat> collateral. And I wish you the best luck, man. You're going to Miami. You're going to a place that you prayed to go to. And I wish you the best, but not better than us. Let's go Rams. Jalen Ramsey, we'll miss you. See you on the next one. Boy, Ricky Rick, I'm out.